Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Yan. I listen to the beat songs, comeback songs, and songs I never heard of for the first time with you all. I like to dance to K-pop and J-pop. If you want to check out my projects, it is here. I'm also learning Japanese and vlogging at the same time, so I can practice both slowly but surely, hopefully. Um, so if you want to check out my simple life, it is here. Lastly, I have another channel called Yan Can Sort of Cook, where I try to make food, but also share what I eat in a day and talk about different food, snacks, drinks, and restaurants with you all. All my hobbies, if you're interested, please explore. Thank you for being here and welcome to my little community. We are listening to another song by Baby Metal just because there's so many recommendations. And so yeah, I will listen to another one today, but we're going back to the past. Um, I forgot which year, but I think <laughs> 10 years maybe but anyways this was a recommendation and so i'll check it out the name of the song we're listening to is catch me if you can can you i mean they're kitsune they're foxes so probably not but anyways i'm guessing it will be very um a little more upbeat and quick paced just because of the title but i won't know until i start listening to it it is a live concert not an mv so new viewers i watched the whole thing first before i talk about it love to hear your um, comments in the comment section too and have a discussion there as well so without further ado let's check out this song right now okay this is in 2014 so yeah 10 years ago Ooh. how old are they um probably probably oh i don't know their ages right now i'm guessing they might be in their 30s or close to it so maybe late teens or early 20s um but this is another live uh, at the botokan um concert hall if you will but anyways let's check it out right now
catch me if you can. No, I cannot catch up with them. So many things that I did not expect and I was just like, uh, what? Eh, well, um, you may not know this when I was watching, but in my head, I was just like, hey, ooh, eh, ooh, huh? Anyways, let's go back. Um, as I keep clicking along, the Kami Ban intro, super cool. Like, I don't know much about playing guitars, but they look really cool. Um, I used to play the violin. With that said, um, I know that the strings can be very hard to play, and the violin strings are a bit thinner than these are electric guitars electric guitars right they're thicker and you use both hands right I feel like it's really hard to get a good grip or having that vibrato thing or just strumming back and forth and so I was really impressed by it um, you can definitely hear the notes clearly but also all the finger movements I was like man and then the bass guy right that's a bass um, I was like, usually they just strum like, you know, very low and just kind of keeping the rhythm before him. He was all over the board too. And those chords or strings are even thicker. And I was just like, oh, the calluses, all the memories of like the pain. Um, but it was really good and they're experts. So I'm sure, you know, they overcame that. And then we have the drumist and I am learning how to play the drums. <laughs> Nowhere near his level. But just looking at the footwork down here, plus all the other movements, I was just like, Oh, 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 okay, okay. <laughs> All right, calm down. So overall, really appreciate them having a good like solid two to three minutes. Um, okay, two minutes of them playing and being part of this part. Um, and then I was like, okay, the girls are out. They're very kawaii. But then there's like this really deep sound that's like, you know, heavy metal, creepy. Not necessarily heavy metal equals creepy, but um, it, it's... Not creepy, like that, oh, I don't know who is singing in the background this low, but a lot of um, heavy metal groups that I've listened to in the past, not baby metal up until now, um, where you have like that low screaming sound and then that type, but then all of a sudden it's like, ah, we're here, ah, I don't know what you're saying, but like, we're really high-pitched cute little girls, and then we go back to this really like, oh, and they're like, ah, so I was just like in my head, eh? what's happening like it's so different and so it was fun but definitely a surprise yet again for me um i'm pretty sure one of the girls is no longer part of the group if i'm correct 10 years ago or maybe they just look extra young i mean they are still young looking but you can tell that they matured a little bit right the baby fat's gone and all of that um but I also noticed like there's a little less singing, but a lot of dancing, a lot of jumping, a lot of movement. I guess do this while you're young. Um, but I also love the stage, how it's like going in a circle slowly. But her stage doesn't, so she really needs to make sure that they are aligned and are facing in the same direction. And so the lighting was really fun. Again, lots of movements happening, super quick pace. I definitely couldn't catch up with them. And yeah, <laughs> but it's fun. Definitely not what I expected yet again. Um, just lots of things to see and also their outfits too. Um, kind of a scaly theme and the maroonish red. I like how they're following each other and looking at different directions um really not sure what they're looking for but it's just very fun to see them have a little storyline in the song um even though there's like less singing so to speak and more music and just more um movements instead so yeah that was really fun it's great to see them like 10 years younger and definitely still very cute and um kawaii and now they're still very cute but more you know ladylike too so i just love to see that transition and change um since i am not watching their songs in order if you didn't notice so yeah continue to support baby metal enjoy catch me if you can thanks for the recommendations and i'll see you in another video thank you goodbye